Hey, Dave Williams, Danielle D. Batito. Here we Got are it. at Whole Foods, and we're making up some salsa today, we right, Danielle? We are. We're going to be making a peach and cucumber salsa in celebration of the sale we have going on tomorrow. Oh, we're today, have, actually, right? Oh, yeah, it's today. I'm sorry. Cool. Today, we're going to have locally grown organic peaches on sale for $1.88 per pound. Wow. Um, there's a really great story behind these peaches. They actually come through South Carolina Grow Food. Okay. And that's a local hub that sort of gets all of our local produce together and gets it into the market. That's amazing because, I mean, normally this time of the year, it's way too early for peaches, but with the warm weather, we've got peaches ready yeah, to go. and great ones here in South Carolina. Oh, yeah. So, so how, yeah, what, how do we get started to make this salsa? Well, I've gotten a little bit of a head start. I've okay. sauteed some local mahi-mahi which we have available in our seafood department and I'm gonna make a really great peach salsa to go on top of it. Let's go for it. I just took the peach and I took the fruit off of the side yep. and I just chopped it up like so. I've got about three in that bowl right there. It's really easy, just get a nice small dice on it. Yep. Put them into the bowl. Um, one cucumber sliced up, an onion diced up, and right here I've got a jalapeno. I like to get it nice and fine so you don't get big spice <laughs> All chunks in your mouth. So we're just going to get one of these that goes right, right in into here. the bowl. Perfect. Now some folks wear gloves when they uh, cut jalapenos. Yeah, they can tend to <laughs> sort of burn underneath your fingernails, but I'm tough. I can handle You're it. You're tough. So we got that. Now, uh, what's that? Is that basil? This is some fresh basil. You can really use any herb that you like. I really like basil because it's really aromatic and it bring, brings out the flavor of the fish and, and the peaches. And you're Italian. And I'm Italian, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> and I just get a nice fine cut on this after I've rolled the basil leaves. Ooh, and the smell on that. Oh, boy, that Isn't smells that good. Awesome? Yeah. And just get that right in there. Okay. Ooh, look at you helping out. Heck yeah. I like to cook. I do a lot of cooking at home. So this peach sale is actually part of an eight-day sale that we have going on to celebrate our eighth birthday, which is coming up on this Saturday. Eight years in Mount Pleasant, eight huh? Eight years in Mount Pleasant, yeah. Wow. So this Saturday here in the store, we'll have a bunch of local vendors sampling all of their products. We'll also have a birthday cake that we're going to be sampling out to customers. $8 Growlers, local Holy City beer at the Growler station. Wow. So lots of really, really exciting stuff here. Now, is this all done? This is all done, yeah. So, so just go ahead and put it on top. Right over top. You got it. I need a little more than that. Yeah, I think so. There we go. Oh, that looks so good. Go for it. Go for it. Let's yeah. give it a try. All right. Now, Danielle, tell me about some of the other uh, the other sales that you have going on in the next couple of days. Well, on Saturday, we're going to have $8 for eight burgers, which is a really, really great mm. deal if you're going to be grilling out over the weekend. Friday. Friday. Mm. Friday. Yeah, Saturday's the party. Sorry, I'm so excited about the party. I'm jumping I the gun. I know. Yeah, mm. Friday, come in. You can get eight burgers for $8, which is a great deal for any of your weekend grilling needs. It's really good, isn't it? It is awesome. And it was really, really simple. All it was was three peaches, one cucumber, one jalapeno, and some fresh basil and a little bit of lime juice. And I thought the jalapeno, I love spice, but I thought it might be a little too much. It's just right. I like it like that. I think a little bit extra spice always good. It is really good. Oh. So you can make this, and you could probably put this on other things too besides fish, maybe. Oh yeah, you can put it inside of a fish taco, you can put it on any sort of grilled meat. Like you could a, even use it as a dip for chips. That's a good idea. I think we need to go get some tortilla chips. So this is awesome. Will you have the recipe for this in the store? Yes, we will. Awesome, you'll have the recipe. And, and tell me once again, I, I am planning on stopping by Saturday for that party. What time's the cake? The cake will be at four o'clock. I like cake. So stop Who on doesn't by like Whole cake? I know. So stop on by Whole Foods. Got some great stuff going on all week. Eighth birthday party right here in Mount Pleasant. Danielle, I can't talk anymore because I'm going to finish eating this. Well, thank you. It is awesome. <laughs> Way to go. All right. We'll be right back with much more Low Country Live.